Hi everyone, it's Ashish from Soft Asia Tech. Are you looking for the best web hosting for WordPress? There is a dirty little secret about all these WordPress hosting companies out there. Only 3 are recommended by WordPress themselves. In this tutorial, I will share some of the top hosting providers for WordPress. So the first one is SiteGround. One of the big pros about SiteGround is it's extremely easy to set up there also one of the three different hosting companies that are actually recommended by WordPress and they also have very affordable pricing and they have extremely fast servers and you get a free SSL certificate which basically allows your site to be more secure but there are some cons of SiteGround one of the first cons is even though it's pretty affordable priced it's still mid tier pricing there are some hosting companies that are cheaper another con with SiteGround is there are plan limits if you are planning to host a ton of videos on your website or totally large images of that SiteGround might not be best option for you up next is bluehost and bluehost is one of the most popular wordpress hosting sites out there it's also the second of the three different hosting companies that are recommended by wordpress they are also one of the most trusted companies out there which bring us to our first con with them and this is true about all different hosting platforms but the way they become so popular so trusted is they were one of the first ones to have an affiliate program the third one is a2 hosting a2 hosting is one of the fastest hosting providers out there basically meaning when people go to your website it's going to load up extremely fast but on the downside they have really poor uptime a2 hosting has one of the lowest uptime percentages out there and they are actually got hacked a few years ago and from i have heard it seems like they still haven't fully recovered from some of that hacks so be careful with a2 hosting hostgator is another extremely popular hosting platform out there now hostgator is actually owned by same company as bluehost but bluehost is actually recommended by wordpress themselves so in my opinion there is really not that big of difference between these two sometimes hostgator are little bit cheaper and sometimes bluehost is a little bit cheaper now there is still one company that's recommended by wordpress we haven't talked about is dreamhost dreamhost is the last of the three different hosting platform that are recommended by wordpress but honestly i don't see any advantage with dreamhost they are more expensive than a lot of other platforms they are also slower and less reliable all right everybody thank you so much for watching the video that was my list of the best web hosting i hope you guys enjoyed the video and got what you came for if you have any question please leave a comment with your question down in the section below i will see you in next video